Greta House is celebrating its 100th anniversary. It was opened in 1912, in December 1912, and has been owned by the same family ever since. This hotel property is not just a hotel. This is, I think, a unique place to be. We experience here a great family atmosphere, family affair, if you want. I'm uh, the front office manager here at Sofreta House. I've been doing this for the past 11 years. The luxurious things, it's the things you feel here at the hotel. You feel the people who personally care for you, they have time for you, and uh, trying to fulfill your wishes before you even mention them. It may be that the client prefers to have a large writing table in his room, which normally is not there, so every time he comes back, he has the same writing table in his room again. Two thirds of our guests are repeat customers. I think they do come back because we are a big family ourselves. They book their vacation and they also book their ski instructor who has been with them for 10 or 25 years. So they make sure that he or she is going to be around when they are here. Our regulars have their table. So we keep track of where they have been sitting. We keep track of what their likes and dislikes are. Our fine dining restaurant, which is called the Grand Restaurant, is the place where our chef, Bernd Ackermann, is creating every day a separate and a new menu every day. 18 plates every day is new. So it's, uh, here the station is all the vegetable and the, the potatoes and the noodles and the rice. This station, all the meat and the fish. And uh, finish, we made the fish and, and the other station. Müssen wir noch mal, haben wir noch irgendwas im Probeteller zum warmen, warmen Probeteller? Gamache, pastry, bakery, yeah. In the morning we make the, the, all the pastas and the, the cakes, the tarts. From the you make your pasta from scratch? Too. Yes, yes. Also the free and these change every day. Every day is uh, three new. You can compare this with other kitchens. It's still state of the art. Of course, it's also the location, especially for families with children, because we have the ski slopes right behind the hotel. There is no valley like this, 1,800 meters above sea level, which is so wide. You're in the mountains, but you don't feel enclosed. The mountains are sort of far away. So just enjoy the, the beautiful scenery, hiking, skiing, restaurants, bars, even shops in the hotel, nurse if you get sick. There's quite a few, they don't even leave the resort. And just stay here and enjoy. i show you something. Here. This is the store history, 50th anniversary <laughs> of Sovretta House. When we renovated our Grand Restaurant, the main dining room, we did find some old menus and you see 1933, what else do we have? 1936. And here we even found a champagne uh, <laughs> cork, 1904. This, for instance, is the original yeah. advertisement which was sitting outside. I found this in a barn. I took it with me and then the first thing we did, hang it up. We have here guests that have been coming for generations. We've had uh, Evita Peron, Staying here, we had the Kennedy family, that's before the war. We had uh, Crown Prince Akihito from Japan. This is one of the greatest challenges you can be offered to run a hotel like Sovretta House. It's an icon of the Swiss hotel industry.